So we're on number two. Number two says parallelogram ABCD is shown below. ABCD, okay? It is known that segment AD has a slope of 4 and a length of 17. So this is on the computer again. This right here is not important necessarily with the numbers. We just want to have something in front of us, so draw it. So I'm going to draw something very similar to it. It doesn't have to be perfect, but we want to have something in front of us so we can kind of work with it. Because this is just seen, do we know what a rectangle is? So it says first, it is known that segment AD has a slope of 4. So that means we go up 4 over 1. So right there, AD has a slope of 4. And a length of square root 17. Which of the following would be sufficient to uh, demonstrate that ABCD is a rectangle? So the key characteristic to a rectangle that differentiates it between a rhombus and uh, a square and a parallelogram is the vertices all are right angles. We need to focus on that. So the first thing, the length of BC is square root 17. This right here, that would not prove that it's a rectangle because we can have a parallelogram where the opposite sides are congruent. So A is not right. The slope of BC is 4 as well. So it goes up 4 over 1. Well, again, that follows the rule of a parallelogram. That's going to be true for no matter what, for a parallelogram or a rectangle. Therefore, not important. The length of AB is 2 square root 17. Well, there's nothing about rectangles where they have to be with the length of it, so that's not there. So the slope of AB is negative 1, 4. So it's not going to be perfect right there because it's probably going to go like two times based off the length. Well, let's look at it. So if AD goes up 4 over 1 and the adjacent side is going to go down 1 over 4, well, looks like the slopes are going to be perpendicular. So the one that makes sense here is negative 1, 4 because the defining characteristic of a rectangle is there's four right angles. So right here, what that's saying basically is that right angles are being formed between all the sides. So that's 4 and this is 1 over 4. They're negative reciprocals of each other. Okay? Just kind of process of elimination and knowing what uh, the key characteristics of a rectangle is.